Hey guys, I got something really exciting to show you today. Today I got the 12 foot Snoopy plane from Lowe's. It's 12 foot wide and it's like almost 6 foot tall. It's very, very big. It, and they have, and Lowe's has this on, and Lowe's has this 50% off, so it's only a hundred bucks. So I, I want, I, you guys should go out and get one, and because. Because it's so cheap and it's pretty big, and here it is right now. It's deflated. Right now, I gotta, I I gotta, I think it's overall. Per, I think overall it's pretty cool. It's just there's just a few problems that this thing has that I'd like to be fixed. Or uh, I'll I'll just explain those to you later. But here it is. I'm gonna plug it in. Oh yeah, it gets covered up by the snow, but yeah, it's pretty much has the same motor as the Grinch sleigh, and all of you, and a lot of you know what the, and that one's another label being sold at Lowe's this year. Hang on, I gotta help it. All right. making sure that wing goes up and so yeah there it is I can't really get it on the camera because of how much room it takes in in here so yeah I'm standing on a couch right now here's part of the Snoopy plane here's another part of the Snoopy plane that propeller spins pretty good for how big it is it's got 10 lights and a little mini Christmas lights that are on the Grinch sleigh. This thing's pretty cool. It's also pretty huge, like I said earlier. It's got two lights in the top, but they don't really seem to light up the, the, the sides over here, which I think which I think is stupid that they don't light up the sides over here. There should probably be more lights in the plane itself. And here's there's Snoopy and Woodstock. Um, my, I got two complaints about that side. I wish on this design that they give Snoopy hands so his hands can stick out of the plane. But whatever. And uh, Woodstock, he doesn't really, he doesn't really stand up that well. He just, he just doesn't really stand up that well. I can show you what I'm trying to say here. Like if I have him like this, if I am like, if I am like this, he's fine. But deflates like this and yeah you can't really yeah sometimes he leans over to the back too much sometimes he leans over here too much it's kind of it's kind of hard to get him up standing up straight but yeah that's Woodstock he's pretty small and this thing's a little bit bigger than me it's like I'd say it's like I, I'd say it's six foot it says that it's like only like five and a half foot like a little taller than five and a half foot but it's 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 six foot though. I think it's six foot. So there's the propeller. There's all this. The tornado fans down there. It's got a little snow bank that sits on. It's got four tether attachments, two here, two here, and two on the other side of the plane. They don't add the they add. They add details to the front, but they don't add them to the back, which I think is stupid of Jemmy. Jemmy's cheap quality horse. And of course, and it has two, it has two tether attachments down here, the stakes on the wheels, and same with the back side of it. Here's the propeller. It has the same. It has a. It has the same. As as their. Uh, it has a spinning mechanism, which I think is pretty cool. Propeller is pretty huge. You can get a, you can see a little bit of the Snoopy plane better. If I do it, at, if I do a video of this guy at Josh's house, then then yeah, it will it will show up much better because it's not because it's actually outside. But yeah, here's the Snoopy plane. And uh, 
one more thing I gotta say about it before I go is that the seam back here is kind of tight on this one. It's like, there's like a little rip right here. Just, it's very small and it's not really spilling out much air, but yeah, I just, I just think the seam's a little too tight on the wing back here. I don't know if, I don't know if all Snoopy Globes have this, if this, if, I don't know if all Snoopy planes have this problem. But yeah, and this one, this one kind of, that one kind of ripped too, or it's, or it's starting to, I don't know. That, I'm just worried that, um, I just hope that doesn't happen to all the scenes on this thing, because this thing's pretty cool, and I just got it today, so I don't want it to, I don't want it to break on the first day, so, you can see it from over here better. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the Snoopy plane. It's 12 and a half foot, I mean, 12 foot wide and 6 foot tall. And yeah, there's the box. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this Snoopy plane. Thanks for watching and bye.